Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to show you exactly how to transfer ownership of a Figma file or project in 2025. Whether you're passing a design off to a teammate, handing over a project to a client, or maybe just tidying up your workspace, transferring ownership is an essential trick to have up your sleeve. By the end of this tutorial, you'll know step-by-step step how to make sure the right person is in charge of your Figma file with the right set of permissions and access. Let's jump right in. First up, open up the Figma file or project you want to transfer. Look towards the top right corner of your screen and you'll spot the share button. It looks like a little icon with a plus sign, and it's your main hub for setting up access. Go ahead and click on that. This will open up the sharing menu where you'll manage who has what access to your file, now here, where you invite the new owner. In the invite field, type in the email address of the person you want to transfer ownership to. Make absolutely sure it's the right email, you wouldn't want to give away ownership to the wrong user by mistake. Once you've got the right address, pay attention to the permission setting beside it, this determines what the invitee can do with the file. You'll want to select Can Edit, since Figma only allows ownership to be transferred to someone who already has editing rights. It's sort of like handing over the keys to your house, you want to make sure they're able to actually come inside and move things around. Once you add their email and set their permission to can edit, go ahead and send the invite. At this point, the ball is in their court for just a moment. The person you're inviting will get an email from Figma, and they'll need to accept the invitation before you can pass on ownership. Don't worry if they don't click it right away. Sometimes these emails land in a spam folder or just get missed, so give them a nudge if you don't see them pop up under the access list after a while. After they've accepted, you'll see their name appear in the Who Has Access list within the sharing menu. This list shows everyone who can see or change your file, and it's the control panel for managing who owns what. Now here's the actual ownership transfer. Next to the new person's name, you'll see a little drop-down menu. Click on that and you'll spot the owner button. This is the magic switch. Once you click it, you're officially handing over the reins. Figma might ask you to confirm this decision since it's a pretty important step. After you confirm, ownership is transferred instantly. The new owner now has full control over the file or project, including deciding who gets access in the future or even deleting the file entirely. And that's it, you've successfully transferred ownership. This is super handy for collaborative teams, agencies, or just whenever responsibility for a file needs to move from one person to another. If you ever get stuck or something doesn't look right, double check that you've given the correct permissions and that the new owner has accepted your invite. Thanks so much for watching. If you found this tutorial helpful, please hit the like button and drop a comment below if you have any questions or run into any snags, I'm always here to help. And don't forget to subscribe for more Figma tips and tutorials. See you in the next video.